in our previous video we have designed uh, about a space now let's design the home page in this video okay now we are at the elementary data interface of the home page okay first hero section hero header should be image slash show background or something like yeah something similar something attractive so let's insert a two column section and padding about 200 at the top 200 at the bottom background of course let's add background yeah it's, let's add a slash show background let's set one or two images as this uh, background image one from diving one from swimming sports something like this okay and just insert it by one position center centered background size go over okay now we need background overlay course the black is the best background overlay mm -hmm. and here coming back here to this okay can burns effect okay mm -hmm. advance motion effects Of, I think that's enough. Now let's insert it here. Swim like a pro, okay. Swim like a Mm -hmm. and the size for about 200 yes swim like a pro I think the padding is little too much go to the section setting in this section uh, let's remove the padding a little 150 what sorry 150 at the bottom now it's okay swim like a pro mm -hmm. okay then another comprehensive training course comprehensive training course Sub training course. I think we need to add few padding to this column, layer right column. 
or even margin is fine yeah margin to the left about 100 mm -hmm. okay then I call this call this widget cut off all that check yeah this one I set it Step by step, step by step guide. Nutrition. Right. Training kids. Love interaction. Okay. Go to style and space between 20 and icon icon size about 20 text in then 20 text color white I think we need to do something here. Go to the section setting, layout, but get align middle. Okay. Then let's insert the button here. Large. Sign up. All call to action for this website is sign up. So we need to convert every visitor to registered on our website. Sign up. Student registration page. Okay, advance margin less at about twenty-five. Yeah, comprehensive training goes step by step guide. I think there is missing something. So what's missing? Zoom like a pro comprehensive training course. I think yeah we, we need to reverse this columns yeah I think something missing so go to uh, remove this left padding a uh, margin and add on the right side 100 I think even we do not uh, need to add here already space in the space so yeah yeah swim like a pro and go to this align to the right zoom like a pro mm.
No. <laughs> it doesn't look good. Yeah. So here what we can add zoom like a pro comprehensive training course is the best stuff guys and blah 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 sign up I think we need to add few descriptive text here the size icon size let's increase to about 25 text typography 25 okay comprehensive training course step by step guide blah 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 okay mm -hmm just like that or hero section is done update it next next is the feature course okay then one column section Adding about 150 to the top, 150 to the bottom. Popular courses. Okay. Text editor. line centered courses you might be interested to learn like this okay and color color does not need to be too black then uh, the inner is uh, mm, then we can insert course I think we have course with that course list yeah course list course carousel yeah course carousel is fine too course carousel yay add first of all margin about 40 to the top mm -hmm. the space m micro uh, micro space here then go to the style arrows and dots no what is fine No need for d 
Dodds as the enemy. Okay, from uh, put the rating content image card. Arrows footer. Price, add to cart button. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Content here image okay image base okay base color base background color yeah this mm -hmm. okay Then I think we need to hide this thing. Writing get na uh, get out Avatar. By Emin. So. Difficulty level. Wish list. Okay. Footer. Yes. But this course by Emin Author Card. Oh, we need the footer. Okay, enroll button. There is no option to change this add to cart text. For example, if I want to change sign up, there is no option here in this editor interface. If you want to change it, you have to go to the WooCommerce setting. Uh, we have to either use uh, custom codes or plugins to change this add to cart button text. Okay, I have a uh, few videos about it. You can check it out it on my channel how to change the add to cart button. If you want to change this, you can change to register or sign up now. Dots. I think dots. It's not necessary. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now let's it. There. Let's leave it to that. Now we are done with this popular courses section. Next, after popular courses, we can insert testimonials. Okay, let's take it out for us. Reviews. Okay, course reviews or reviews. 
what is this course review this is I think part of the single course product rating I see something here we have to decide it for us either we are going to uh, use depend on the course rating here in this rating for the testimonials or for the social influencing so social proof or either we are going to use custom testimonials we gathered from our customers through Google reviews or Facebook or whatever where you uh, receive feedbacks from the customers yeah most of our website designs uh, we use those uh, custom testimonials on our web web page website so we have to decide it depend on it but i think it will be too confusing since there is this rating system on our course then just leave it to that so we do not need to add these testimonials i originally planned to so next is gallery so we need to show a few uh, galleries about what we have done so far those yeah teaching uh, swimming training photos or videos you have to show off or uh, of a few <laughs> okay here so let's uh, duplicate this section We do not need this course. Okay, delete it and go to in this section while we are at this section setting. Let's add little background. yeah transparency just below to differentiate little from this white background color okay from the galleries take a pick at what we have done in these years Blah, blah blah okay then the gallery yes gallery gallery here set it so I'll just use these sample images in singular. I think it is too much, <laughs> too much images. Uh, too much is not good. We just have to showcase few nice ones about okay. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that's fine. Let's set it. Okay. 
Okay, columns three. Mm -hmm. And by default, it is grid machinery. Mm, doesn't look good. Machinery looks good when we have the combination of portraits, landscapes, squares. But here, this is just in different size images. <laughs> doesn't look good. Mm, I think I will just stick to the grid. Order random. We have few gallery options, but we do not need it. And here, link to media file or custom URL. Mm, yeah, link to media file. We don't want to alter too much here. Just we have want to showcase what we have done so far in these few pixel images. Okay. And pounds at margin about forty to give this micro space, micro writing if space, writing space, and then. Yes, last the call to action. I think we can copy this from here. Just edit this about a space. Okay, copy this section from the border space and come back to our home page and paste it here. Okay, yeah instead of designing from scratch again we can use it those are pre-designed sections to save time and to stay uniform and consistent throughout the website that's it and we are over about this home page yeah yeah i used to add many things on the home page everything you need you need to see uh, in the website I, I put on the home page but i came to realize that I came. I learned later that, yeah, g giving too much information is not good. Yeah, there's a. We just need to give few key informations and guide the visitors to our call to actions. Okay, so that we can convert them. Yeah, so basically what they need is on this hero section when just landed on a website swim like a pro whatever comprehensive training course and a few key features here and yeah sign up and if, uh, if they want to see more about our website when they can see the popular courses our website this is what we we do in our this company or website and they get the information here the ratings price and all then they get to see few things that what other students are doing what the instructors are doing over the years from this gallery this is activity uh, photos or videos then then we just have to let them sign up now that's it if they want to see more information they uh, can never get here with this sticky header to other pages of the website that's it yeah yeah we are done we are done for this episode thanks for watching this video and i hope you learned something new if you are yeah helpful if you find this helpful don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe my youtube channel stay tuned for latest episodes and uh, other tutorial videos about how to design a wordpress website from scratch step by step with and uh, this base builders yeah, in the future i might also do other base builders like yeah oxygen breezy zion these are the new popular 
uh, page builders and yeah we may also design the, this website with Gutenberg editor so if you are interested in those videos please don't hesitate to contact me and leave a comment below any video requests I will try to yeah, do those videos okay see you in the next episode